Good afternoon guys, this is Greg Travis and today you are Grubbing with Greg. Buckle your seatbelts guys, because I'm about to pour you a tall glass of this is what it is and this is how it tastes. Today's flavor, Popeyes. And just to be clear, I did get the regular and the spicy chicken sandwiches, so look at that, these two I, oh. I was about to say I don't know which is which, but this pretty much tells me which is which. Let's start with the regular. Wow. Pretty big piece of chicken for a sandwich. As soon as you bite into it, it's got that, it's got that loud crunch too. By the way, their strawberry lemonade is legit. All right, that's the regular out of the way. Let's try the spicy. Hey, with some places I can sometimes forget how spicy spicy can be, so that's why I got water on standby. And there's sauce in my hands. That's better. Wow, how do I? <laughs> Okay, I'm tasting some spice, but wait, yep, there it is. Wow. <laughs> Apparently their spicy sauce is kind of like those uh, slow motion sauces where it takes a few seconds for the spices to kick in. And this probably took about probably 15, maybe 20 seconds a month, at least. Hold on, let me try this again. Mm. Okay, never mind. That was almost immediate. Probably because I had more sauce on that one side. Oh. All right. Next, I got the uh, honey lemon pepper wings. Well, I can smell the honey. And I don't know whether or not I can smell the lemon. What do I start with? This one right here. Hmm. 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 Honey and spice, not the best combination. Honestly, it's honestly the contrast of the honey and the spice and the lemon. I think it's just honestly, I'm confused. 
thing. It doesn't really make that much sense. What are these? Ah, fries. They're Cajun fries. Okay, these are good. These are good. I'm not going to lie. They are definitely not bad. <clears throat> All right, next. I got their mashed potatoes and gravy. But now I got a bit of a pull on top, so let me stir this up. Hmm. Hmm. I'm not too sure what it is I'm smelling about the gravy. Is Would it be the gravy or is it just... I don't know. Ooh. If you guys want comfort food, this is definitely the this is definitely the side dish you should go for when you're thinking about Popeyes. Hmm. They definitely had the right gravy for this. <laughs> All right, next. I got their home style mac and cheese. And for those of you that don't know, I love mac and cheese. So, pretty mushy. Yeah. Yep. As I said before, you want good comfort food? The mashed potatoes and uh, the mac and cheese are definitely the side dishes to go for first. Not too sure how they make the mac and cheese other than uh, macaroni and cheese. No pun intended. But they definitely headed off in the right direction. All right, finally. I decided to get their caramel apple cheesecake cup. It literally looks like an oversized Reese cup. And I'm going to need a different fork for this. Thankfully, the Popeye staff packed three for me. God, so creamy. Oh, wow. That is one of the best cheesecake combinations I've ever had. And it definitely, you could definitely taste the caramel and the apple flavors too. This is definitely one of the best, one of the best options for cheesecake at all. All right. Overall, I think this is a really good place. And I would probably uh, rate this on a... <sighs> I don't want to go too high. So, maybe seven? Maybe seven? Maybe seven and a half? And other than the sides... I think the best thing, the best thing I would go for, that I would recommend, would be the chicken sandwiches, if not the chicken chicken itself, because I saw that there were 
big box deals for their uh, uh, actual chicken thighs, chicken legs, chicken breasts, and uh, chicken wings. Why didn't I think about getting those? Anyway, that wraps it up for today. If you guys have any uh, food recommendations or uh, places you guys want me to give a try, please comment down below. And don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. This is Greg Travis. Thank you guys for grabbing with Greg.